on this video I will be explaining to you what diatomic elements are. I mentioned this word diatomic elements previously but I didn't really talk about them much so I'm making this video just to show you what they are and what elements are diatomic. So they are actually called homonuclear diatomic molecules but you can just call them diatomic elements or molecules. So, there are some elements that in nature exist as diatomic, it means that there are going to be two of them. The most common one is oxygen. You know, you don't write oxygen like just an O, except if it's in, in a compound. If you want to write oxygen by itself, you will actually write it as O2. So this doesn't work. And that is because oxygen in its natural form has two two molecules of, of oxygen combined together. There are seven elements that exist as diatomic elements in nature. And they're all they're all non metals, so that is good for you to know. So the first element we mentioned was diatomic was oxygen. The other one that there are six more so the first the second one would be bromine there is chlorine two that would be three fluorine iodine nitrogen and the last one the seventh one hydrogen so I know they're not easy to remember but people usually make some like sentences using the, the sign letters or well for my case I heard a lot about Brinkelhoff so something like that so BR I N C L H O F so it sounds something like Brinkelhoff and so you have here bromine iodine, nitrogen, chlorine, hydrogen, oxygen, and the last one again, fluorine. So, you would actually have to write it like with the twos for you to not forget, because that is the point, they are all diatomic. So you can find different ways to memorize it. I've heard about Hofbrinkel and people making different words to just memorize them, but it is up to you how to want, how you want to memorize the diatomic elements.